Welcome back friends. In this video, we are going to discuss about sending email with attachment and HTML body content using ASP.NET Core MVC. Okay, let's start writing the program. Okay, here select a create new project. Search MVC here. You can see this template ASP.NET Core Web App Model View Controller. Select that and click next. Uh, give a project name, email attachment. This is my project name. Then click on next. I don't want HTTPS for now. I'm unselecting it. So Current version is 5.0, .NET 5.0. I have a 6.0 preview installed. So I'm selecting 6.0. Create. Yeah, this is my MVC application. This is my home controller. And these are the views, home controller views, index and privacy. So here, this is my home controller. I don't want this logging enabled. And I just, will just keep index and privacy. For post call, I will create a post method. HTTP post. Okay, here uh, this is my email sending post call. So I will have a to email parameter and uh, file to send attach. These are the two parameters I'll get from the UI and here I'll declare global declaration. This is the place where I will uh, declare my global variables. And this is my mail body, HTML mail body. And uh, string from email. This is my from email, your email. So you can put your email and to email is coming from the method body from UI. So here a mail title. Attachment demo. So here string mail subject subject is a email with attachment and mail password your mail password so uh, this is the from email and uh, the password you should provide for this email so whatever the mail you are providing here you need to provide that mail password here so that from that account email will be sent okay for easy understanding, I'll remove that there and here. So this is the email and this is the password. Okay, these are the global variables. And this is the uh, get call, get index. So it will simply returns the view. Nothing needs to be done here. And this is the post call. So here email sending functionality will be written. Okay, so first we need to write a mail body, mail message creation. After that, we will create a mail content. After that, we will attach the mail attachment, then server details, server details, then credentials. So these are the uh, blocks, code blocks we are going to write. So let's write a mail message here. So if you want to send an email, you need to write a mail message. You need to create a mail message object. So this required a namespace. 
using system.net.mail that's the namespace i have added it then i'll message equal to new message so to this mail message i will give a from which mail account i want to send email okay so here i'll create a new mail address this new mail address is for from email so from email is the this one we just now created and the mail title okay from this mail address to new mail address to email so this is the mail message i want to send from this email to this email this is the mail message let's create a mail content so message dot subject what is the subject mail subject so mail subject we have created a variable global variable here this is my mail subject okay then what is the message body subject is that one and message dot body equal to sorry what is the variable we have declared mail body so mail body is the so mail body is of type html so we need to mention that one here message dot is body html equal to true okay because we are sending body as a html content that's why we need to put a is body html equal to true so we have created a mail message then we have created a mail content then we need to add attachment so here message dot attachments dot add so for, to the mail to the message object there is the attachments property so to this we need to add attachments any number of attachments okay so to this one we need to create a new attachment so this is the file we will get from the ui from the host back so here file to attach dot open read stream that's my file stream then what is the file name file to attach dot file name that's it okay i have created a new attachment with the file stream then adding it to my attachments okay yeah this is how we will attach the file this is how we will attach the file to the mail message body mail message if you want to attach one more uh, attachment you can simply do this one mail message uh, dot attachments dot add if you want to do an another attachment you can simply do like this okay for now i want to add only one attachment then the server details smtp server details so here we need to create a smtp client object smtp client smtp dot host so what is the host i am sending it from the i want to send the email from my outlook uh, email that's why i want to mention it like sm tp dot office 365 com this is the host address for outlook mails or uh, hotmail or live mails and then smtp dot port equal to 587 587 is a normal port for smtp and smtp dot enable ssl equal to true then smtp dot delivery method delivery method equal to smtp delivery method dot network so these are my server details and what are the credentials so here are my credentials 
system dot net dot network credentials credentials equal to new network credentials credentials dot username equal to from email then credential dot password equal to email password so what is mail password so from email and mail password are the global variables we have declared just before okay these are the username and password then smtp dot use default credentials equal to false because we are saying use these credentials not the default ones smtp dot credentials equal to credential okay so we are saying don't use default credentials use these credentials then last step is the send email smtp dot send that's it this is the email sending functionality with attachment okay this is how you will add attachment and these are the global variables let's go to the ui go to view so this is my ui i want to write a ui functionality here so here i want to write a, at the rate using HTML dot begin form of this is my action method comma controller home controller comma form method dot post comma I want to mention because we are uploading a file we are we are having a file select so here we need to uh, set a form uh, encryption type equal to multi part slash form data so if you have a form file upload then you need to have this one okay so i have just created a form form tag with the action method and controller name uh, my method type is a post and encryption type is a multi-part form data so if i have a method type as a post then it will call the http post method here so i am saying index method http post so that index method post call okay it will submit it to that action method so let's write the simple form so i want to write class equal to row then div class equal to form group i want to write it of four so this is my form i want to have it four time because one row is equal to 12 grid parts so this one is a two this one is a six i want to have yeah so 4 8 then uh, sorry 4 plus 2 is 6 6 plus 6 is a 12 12 is equal to one row okay bootstrap so here i want to have a input tag type email so i want to have a class as a form control so i want to have a name this name should match this one otherwise it won't map the data so that's next i want to have a input of type of file then copy it paste the name change the name file to attach file to attach okay i have simple email text box file control then submit button input type equal to submit value equal to send email so i want to show it in a interesting good color i want to give a css class btn btn success okay that's it we are done preparing the ui also. okay let's write a success message here after sending an email i want to display a success message if view bag dot email send message not equal to null then display a label at the rate the same one so let's give some class bg success i want to display it in some green color okay so then we need to we need to assign a message after sending all this one view bag dot world email sent successful okay then this message will be displayed here once the email is sent okay let's test it this is the email i want to i will receive this is the email i will receive one okay let's run this application
so nehan world at the outlook.com is the email i want to select a file this is the file i want to send and i'm clicking on send email so it is saying email sent successfully let's go to our email see we have received the email this is the email html content we have used so welcome to nehant world so please find the attached files this is the sample file we have attached the content is this is a sample attachment okay we can download that text file and if you see it this is a sample attachment okay this is the attachment we have attached this is the email title we have used this is the email and this is the email title and this is the subject okay so this is the html body yeah this is the demo this is the this is how we will send email with the attachment using asp.net core msc c sharp thank you for watching